All right. In this tutorial, what we want to talk about is how you can use Moodle to create an HTML or a text page. Now, a lot of times you're going to have material already prepared, and it's going to be in a PowerPoint format, a Word file. It's going to be, a, you know, in an Excel document. And what we've shown you already is that you can just upload those files into Moodle and point directly to them. Occasionally, you may have the text from an email. You may have text already written in Word. Instead of uploading the Word document, you want to just use Moodle to create a HTML page, have it linked directly from Moodle so that they can just click on it. You don't have to worry about whether they have Word. You don't have to worry about whether they have, um, you know, a PDF reader. They can just click on a link and open a text file or a Word document or an HTML document. It's a really easy way to distribute some real basic, simple content. So what we want to do is show you how to do that. So what we want to do is click Turn Editing On. Now what we're going to want to do is assume that you already have the, the document written or that you're going to write it in, directly into Moodle. Now what I recommend that you do is write it in Word first, copy it, and then just paste it, or paste it as I'll show you. So we're going to go to Add a Resource, and in this case you can go to Compose a Text Page or Compose a Web Page. They're essentially the same. The only difference is the text page will be text. The web page can use, um, you can pull in code from pre-existing websites. So I'm going to go to Compose a Web Page. It's going to ask for a name. So I'm going to say Week 1 Directions. I'm going to say, give it a description. And now here's where it says compose a web page. Now as you'll notice from the other tutorials, this is the same WYSIWYG editing. This should look just like Word. You should be familiar with these. Again, if you don't know what something is, you just mouse over it and it'll tell you. In this case, that's create an anchor. So what I'm going to do is I've already had this stuff written out, so I'm just going to paste it in here. And I pasted it in. I copied it from a Word document previously. Um, I pasted it in by going to Edit Paste. In here, you can format everything directly in here. You can change the font. You can change the colors. That's up to you. So if I wanted to change everything, all the font to Arial, I could do so. You could uh, do whatever editing you need directly in here. And when you click Save and Return to Course, that page will automatically be added to Moodle. And when the students see that link, they could click on it. And regardless of what programs they have on their computer, it'll open directly up uh, for them, uh, just like a, an HTML page. And they'll easily be able to see it. So if you have quick content that you have in a file like Word, doesn't include a lot of tables, charts, graphics, I recommend that you just copy it, paste it right in the Moodle. It's a real easy way to get the content out to your students.